Welcome back guys, my name is Kobo Man and this is a Windows 10 tutorial series. In this video I'm going to show you how to change background in Windows 10. So this is basically tutorial series for beginners or maybe people that just need to familiarize themselves with Windows 10 since it's different, since it's so different for example of Windows 7 which majority people are still using. Okay, so this is basically help you transition into Windows 10. Okay, so if you haven't checked out my previous video on how to change your resolution on your Windows 10 computer, I'll go ahead and post a link right here. Okay, so let's get to it, guys. Um, in, let's, so how do we change our background? So we, you know, this is a beautiful background that actually comes with Windows 10, but you know, let's change it to something else. Uh, there are a couple of ways of going about this. First way is anywhere on your desktop, uh, with your mouse, right click anywhere, and then select personalize. So right click anywhere on the desktop and select personalize. <coughs> Excuse me. And here we are, very first window is our background, right? So in order to change our background, we can choose from different pictures that we have here, but we can also change it to solid colors or even change it to a slideshow, basically, well, you know, let me kind of backtrack a little bit here. First thing that's selected here on the background is picture, right? And here you can simply change, click on any of these pictures that are down here and it will change the background. As you can see here, it changes the background automatically and that's great. And if, but if you want to use a custom picture for your background, you will select browse, okay? And then navigate to where your pictures are. So if you save your pictures to your desktop, you would select desktop right here and then you would basically you know select the picture you want to use or any any you know part of your uh, you know if let's say you saved it to c drive right let's go to your computer just select your computer here and then navigate to anywhere you'd like so um, you know just go to c drive for example and you know anywhere that you have saved your picture you would select it and then you would simply just change it okay and then right down here you can choose how it fits so if your picture is not big enough, you would select how it fits. So under where it says choose a fit, you would basically sell it. Um, you would basically select it and tell it to whether fill in the full screen, to fit it, to stretch it, tile it, center it, or span, span it across. Okay. So you just kind of fill with it and see what which, which works better for you. See how it changes. Um, it's not very. Uh, um, noticeable once you have a picture that fits perfectly uh, but you know if you have a picture that's small you will certainly notice a difference and then uh, by default it's set to fill which is fine for most pictures but you know feel free to experiment see what you like best okay so on their background we have a couple more options we can choose a solid color so if you click where it says on the background then select picture and then um, select solid color and here it gives you a bunch of different solid colors that you can pick from okay and you don't have to click apply or anything like this as soon as you select one color or a picture it automatically just changes you don't have to go back and select apply so any of these you can change to a solid color and the third option we have is a slideshow so if you collect on a slideshow you can choose an album or a bunch of pictures at once so basically in order to have this working properly um, you can um, basically collect select browse and select the port you know location of the the folder with your picture so if you have family pictures you would basically navigate to it so let's say you have it uh, let's kind of go back to desktop you select desktop and let's say your folder is in there called family album you would select that and click choose this folder same difference if you go to local C drive or anywhere else or your thumb drive you know, depends where you have it, choose, and then you select choose the folder, and then from here you can basically pick which, which pictures you want to be part of your slideshow, and so on and so forth. Very simple here. Okay, and then down here you can choose the interval um, of uh, basically how often the picture changes. By default, it's set to 30 minutes, but you can change it. You can set it up so it changes every one minute, every 10 minute, every one hour, or, or once a day, six hours if you will. And then the same difference on how you want to fit it. You know, you can same difference for any pictures, so which is down here, choose a fit. Okay, well that's one way to get into it. 
So a second way of getting to the same place where you can change your uh, Windows background is if you go to search bar down here and just type in choose background. So the first thing that will come up is choose background. You select that. And here we are. This is the exact same place we were at. And here you can change your settings. Well, there you have it, guys. This is how you would change your desktop background on your Windows 10 computer. So, guys, if you find this useful, share this video with friends and family. Um, look forward to more uh, tutorials for Windows 10. And then uh, I'll see you next time, guys. Have a good one. Bye-bye.